honey knows all you need is one yes, yes. it may take a few years you only need one to be blessed never give up middle finger up fuck stress fuck be an apology To my bro Johnny over here, man. Yep. Does all the interiors. If you need anything, making it happen. Definitely hit him up, man. He's out. He's located out in Connecticut. I came all the way from Brooklyn for this. It was definitely worth it, man. Take a few years. You only need one to be blessed. Never give up. Middle finger up. Fuck stress. Fuck being apologetic. Fuck any type of regrets. I laugh when they talk bad about me. Life too short to live somebody else's vision. The dream only God could judge. So it's been about two weeks since I made the video. I uh, haven't really done anything with fashion. I mean, I've been modeling here and there, but I haven't recorded anything. But what I'm gonna record is my car. That's a five series starting up. You see it when it come out. But look what I got. I got my Emola red interior, man. Oh, that's my boy. Shit like that. Ooh, man, There's so much beamers on the block. Oh yeah, that's a that's a Cali edition three twenty eight over there. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get a little more. I'm gonna get closer to that one. That's my first time seeing one of those two. I've never seen a Cali 318 in person. But yeah, man, we're doing this. New oil pan. We be walling in Stewie car, my nigga, and that shit's still bugging. That shit is fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> so imagine that's three A one. Teeth in the night. They got wet inside. So I got my door panels in. I got the top up, back top in. Door panels. I still gotta clean this out. I could see it. Look what I got. Ooh. Ooh, my goodness. Oh my goodness. Look at this. I finally put it in. I didn't put it in the front seat yet because I had it shampooed and vacuumed. And I have a leak because of this. 
And there's a bunch of water underneath here. So that had to get soaked out from there. Um, when I was pressing on this at first, it was like literally water, but the guy that came, they came and um, they vacuumed out all that water. So we're looking nice and clean. I'm actually gonna put in just a driver's seat because I want to lift up this side of the carpet. See if I could draw underneath there some more, but so far it's looking so good, man. My more interior. As you can see, I'm here fucking sweating like crazy. This humid ass summer day. Just finished finally putting the last pieces to my car. I don't know if you guys could see it, but I can see it from here. I finally got my interior in my car. I still gotta get my grills. I um, actually have that corner light. I gotta just get some right here. It got like bent in, so I have to like take that to the body and see if you could do something right there. I got one of my new fog lights in because I was like, fuck it. If I could put one in, I might as well do it now. As a matter of fact, anybody can let me know what size grills is these. I think these are 97, but I'm not sure. But um, yeah, I think I said that before. But yeah, I got to install a bracket for that fog light. But here's the moment. Ooh. Ooh, look at this. Got my ring on. Steering wheel. So I'm gonna go ahead and say it now. I do remember one guy having an E36 with a red interior in it. His name was E46 Keith. I think he was out in Queens. But I don't think he has that anymore. So I'm gonna go ahead and say it. I think I may be the only person in Brooklyn or the tri-state area with red guts and his E36 S52 swaps today. If you know anybody with it, let me know. Because as of now, I think I'm the only person with it. Ooh, this shit is clean with my black headliner. I gotta get my sunroof fixed. It's dented. I gotta get that fixed. I gotta find the piece that covers that. But I think everything else is good. I have to finish put together my, I guess the back of my center console. I probably won't fix that. I don't know, I gotta buy those parts over. All I really gotta do left is connect the seat belts. And that's that, man. Breaking up fresh, that's Kodak. Killing these niggas, you know that. Real street nigga, you know that.